And here's the net, next set of examples of how to use logarithms, and in particular how to use the, the rules of logarithms to simplify these expressions. So we're supposed to now write it as a single logarithmic expression. And so the first thing we're going to do is whenever we see a number in front of the log of x, like here, we can put that and make it the exponent of the variable. So in this case, this can be written as the log of x to the third power plus the log of y to the fourth power. And, and then you remember the rule that when we have the log of a times b, that can be written as the sum of the log of a plus the, the log of b. So here we can work in reverse. So you have the log of x cubed plus the log of y, y to the fourth power. That can now be written as a single logarithmic expression of x cubed times y to the fourth power. All right, looking at our next example, now we have three terms there. So here we have 2 times the log of x minus 3 times the log of y, so we can use that and put that as an exponent. So we have the log of x squared minus the log of y cubed minus the log of z. And now we remember the rule that when we add like this, we can multiply the two, um, the two values. And here when we subtract, we can divide. So this can now be written as the log of x squared in the numerator and both the y cubed and the z in the denominator, like so. And finally here, we have one-fifth times this quantity, so the first thing we're going to do is multiply this through. So we have one-fifth times the log of x minus one-fifth times the log of y. And now we can use that and write it as an exponent, so this can be written as the log of x to the one-fifth power minus the log of y to the one-fifth power. And now again, we use the rule that when we subtract, we can write it as a fraction, so this is equal to the log of x to the one-fifth divided by y to the one-fifth. So you could potentially write this as the log of the quantity x over y to the one-fifth power. All right, so that's how you use the logarithms to take a complicated expression and make it into a single logarithmic expression.